Hi guys. So uh, today I am going to show you how to uh, get magnets, uh, magnets and uh, other fun stuff out of an old uh, hard drive. Uh, this is from an old computer. Make sure that the hard drive that you don't use it uh, because it will not work after this. Uh, if you are a parent, check with your kids. If you are a kid, check with your parents. Otherwise, kids or parents may get angry. You're gonna need a uh, screw set, screwdriver set made for uh, small components like electronics and stuff. Uh, we are going to use mainly at first uh, the T8 Torx key. Uh, I have already screwed these out, so you won't have to watch me do it. Do it. It will take a while, otherwise. Anyways, so uh, oh, by the way. There will be some screws beneath uh, this, uh, what's the name of it, uh -huh. sticker. Uh, so just make sure you have screwed every, everything out before lifting the lid off. Otherwise it won't get off. I will try to fix this angle. Just open it up like this. Oh, cool. So, uh, it's like a mirror. Yeah. So, this is it's two discs. It is this one, and then there's one beneath it. And uh, here is the magnets inside of uh, this uh, little uh, protecting skeleton, I guess. Yeah. Say? Protected metal. Yeah. Uh, so I think, yes, now we are going to screw these things out, but first... Okay, <laughs> but first let me take a <laughs> selfie. <laughs> yeah. uh, switch out the T8 Torx key uh, to a smaller one. I think this should do it. I will try. This is a T5. Is that the small one? It's too small, probably a T6, yeah. I will want to use them. So yes. first for the chassis is a T8 and then on the inside is a T6. Six. Okay. Exactly. Hmm. This might be a little annoying, especially since the disc will uh, Rot <laughs> rotate yeah, I, yeah rotate okay no need I got that. it now uh, so from what I know the magnets will be exactly as strong uh, no matter what how big the size of uh, how many gigabytes the disk is so don't don't take a new one just because you think it will have better magnets it won't are there more magnets than one in this disc yes there is uh, two bigger ones and then there is one small one uh, and then there is also these discs uh, if you want to you can Use them as a mirror or something. And there is also a few, I think there's one or two electrical motors in this too that uh, you can use for other experiments. This yeah, last uh, one was uh, really annoying. Make it telescope. Oh yeah, um, I f yeah. There's also screws. No. No. Screws in the wallet and slip out. Then sit fast there. Yeah. It's attached here on the reading head. So I think you will. Maybe you will need. No, this fits. Those Just magnets. lift it out like this, 
Uh, these are not magnets, this is just plastic to... Uh, okay. This is the one uh, that writes the memory of on okay, the right. discs. Yeah. And here is the motor that drives it. I have still not figured out how to use that motor, actually. <laughs> okay. I've tried ma many times. So here is one magnet, that uh, little thing you see here. Let's see if I can zoom in. And uh, yeah. now we will uh, need to. Uh, it is actually a big motor behind here that is really easy to use with uh, this uh, electronics card. So we will switch back actually to the T8 Torx key. There was should be this one. Yeah. Yes. So you can do this actually at first. I forgot to do that. So now it's out. Mm -hmm. um, yes, this should be loose now. Looks like it. Yes, I think so too. Uh, just take this little uh, tape thingy off uh, so you can disconnect the motor from the electronics card. Uh, then you can uh, Take it off and continue your work. This was a irritating one. Do you how do you remember? Bother lost fingers. Act as if to cut it. Any finger? Yeah, I know. So, so yeah. this is something you shouldn't do. Uh, you should, should never point the knife towards your hand because then you can be 100% sure that sooner or later you will cut yourself. Yeah. So don't do that again, please. Okay. I think I got it loose. This was Does it matter? Just cut it off because you're not going to use it. Yeah, but I can't cut this off then it won't work. The motor won't work then. So instead of pointing the knife towards your hand, you can just scratch like this, lift the tape, and try to pull it loose, like this. Thank you. No problem. And uh, now just disconnect this thing. How do you do that? You simply wiggle it out wiggle like Wiggle it? This. <laughs> okay. Yeah. And then should be able to uh, oh, get the card nice. off like this and then there will be uh, more screws on the back <laughs> here uh, these are the one uh, attaching these things okay now the discs and now fell the out. discs fell out too cool so uh, that, oh, are, that's what, not what? good though uh, yeah so here you might see the discs and uh, so two this discs one? for this one? Yes. But, but that differs mm, depending on the hard drive, right? Yes, I think so. This is actually... Uh, some of these parts look a little different from the other hard drive I did, even though they are uh, the same make. Uh, you they company. You uh, even made a necklace out, yeah. of, uh, out of another hard drive, this part he, that you used, right? Yes. And then you just attach it. It pretty much looks like a really cool necklace. And nobody knows what it is. <laughs> Let's see if I can get this screw out. 
So what, what, what is it that you are trying to do now? Uh, I am trying to get ah, these good. things loose like that. Now I will also need to get this off. After the finger on. Yeah. Do I can just get it instead? No, I got it. I got it. Okay. I think those uh, plastic bits and uh, tape and stuff, uh, they are uh, there because of uh, if you want to return the disc on warranty. But we are not so very concerned with that anymore. Oh. Anyways, now they should have... Yeah, they yeah. are loose. Like this now. And these two? are uh, two uh, very powerful magnets if I can get them loose like I said they are very powerful so yeah I tried them too and uh, on another disc and they are very 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 yeah. powerful for being so small because most of the thing that you see right there is the metal chassis so the actual magnet is how big this is uh, the kidney <laughs> formed thing yes yeah, uh, this is the magnet, and the rest of it is just the chassis. Um, so those are really, really strong. You can actually, uh, at least this one, I have managed to uh, get it off from the chassis. Uh, so uh, take a knife in here and just bend. I won't do that now. Okay. Uh, but because I'm watching or <laughs> no uh, this knife I don't know if it would uh, I don't know so you need a very strong something maybe yeah. a screwdriver or something instead exactly. is, is better and here is if you can zoom in the other very small magnet just uh, well, uh, poke uh, it out of there if you much. point again you can uh, maybe show where it was sitting it will uh, sit right here like this okay and uh, the chassis on this one, so to say, it is uh, rubber, I think, right? And here, this is uh, also a very strong magnet for being so small. Uh, all three of these magnets are uh, new Dimimum magnets, I think that's the name of them. Really strong, rare earth magnets is another name of them. Now, okay, so if you have small kids at home... Don't uh, let them come close to these because if they swallow one and yeah it can do some serious injury yes because uh, to the intestines uh, they can attach themselves and cause mayhem yeah uh, so we are also going to get these screw loose why because this is the motor and it is a very powerful one i have tried uh yours yeah, because the motor spins the discs up to 5,000 uh, RPMs. Yes, that's not right. Uh, we're still using the T8 key, Torx key. Um, I am actually also going in another video to show you how to uh, use a mod. No, uh, a. Uh, What's the name of uh, what's the motherboard? The power supply. Yeah, the power supply for a computer without the motherboard, and uh, you can do all fun stuff, very much fun stuff with it. So this should be loose by now. No. Maybe you just have to whack it. Yeah. Like that, just uh, do what he did. <laughs> Anyways, it looks like this. Shiny, nice. Uh, so it is pretty hard to use it just by itself like this. Uh, you're going to have to uh, connect it to the card. The, the or, to some, card. or to something that drives it. Yeah. yeah. It has one of these, so plug it in like... Uh, like it was before, maybe? Yeah, <laughs> exactly. 
Du vet hur det visar det. Like that. And uh, just plug this, uh, plug this on into the power supply. Anyways, try this at home please, but do it with a uh, hard drive that you, you're not using yourselves. Uh, that's it for today. Over and out guys. Bye.